Today, I'm gonna be showing you how to animate your hood, your trunk, and your pipes, man, on your cars, man, in GTA. All right, so open up Zmodeler if you have it, and get it ready. Click the link in the description. It'll take you to this car right here. Download that. This is what we're using for the tutorial. Get it inside Zmodeler. If you don't know how to import a car, man, go watch my old video. I got another video showing you how to import cars. So uh, go check that out. And then uh, jump back to this video. For the people that already know what to do, come on, man, open up Zmodeler. Open up a second view. Boom, zoom in. That's the chassis right there, all right? So what we're gonna do is, we're gonna go to, matter of fact, let's select that. Let's go to single up here. Highlight it, right click. All right, then what we're gonna do is we're gonna go to polygon mode at the top, left click over here in the, in the open space. Boom. Pull out the dots everywhere. I went to perspective mode right here. Turn the car so you can see it. All right, now what we're gonna do is we're gonna hit separate it. And then we're gonna click a piece of the pipe. Right there. Select the whole pipe almost. We're gonna do it over here too. I'm right clicking, right click. Just letting you know, right click. All right, selecting that pipe. All right, so there's a little piece on the tip of the pipe that isn't selected. So we're gonna select that too. Zoom in. If this doesn't work for you, you can go right here to use them. Turn the car on, look, zoom all the way in. All right, right click, and yeah, we got that pipe selected. I think it's two pieces, the inner and the outer, so select both of them, all right? Or if you don't wanna do that, you can go right here to element, click element, and it's gonna select that whole pipe piece. All right, so we're gonna do that, we're gonna do the element on this one, so you can see what I'm talking about. Just select the whole thing. All right, so um, take off element, zoom out. Now, we're gonna separate these pipes from the chassis because everything on that's, that's showing dots right now is the chassis. So go up here to modify. Go right here to under sub mesh. Go to the fourth one that says detaches polygons from the object. I don't think you have to click on the object. I think you can click anywhere. No, you have to click on the object. All right, so click right there on the object, boom. Now, the chassis, we're gonna close the chassis, or hide the chassis. I see you see the pipes is there, so the pipes are not attached to the chassis anymore. All right, so now you got some pipes on here. All right, so when you detach from anything, it's going to, <clears throat> Put the same name from what you detached. So even though it's not attached to the chassis, the, the name of the pipes is chassis down here. We're gonna change that to pipes. All right. Matter of fact, don't do that. Change that to engine block. We're gonna change it to engine block. Yeah, 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 yeah. Now what I want y'all to do is before we do anything else. Go right here to convert to compound. Yes. And that's gonna make this bold. And it's gonna be how it's supposed to be in the game. All right, so now we can drag this back up. We can actually put it right here up under the engine. All right. Boom. Now I go up here, hit select, hit none to deselect the pipe. All right, so now we don't have anything selected. But right now, since uh, engine block is the pipe, when you get in game, the pipe will be shaken. If you need anything to be shaken, you must name it engine block, all right? Or, or vibrating, or, you know, doing that little stutter movement of, of, you know, like an engine is running. That's what engine block does in Z model. So uh, anything that you want to shake, man, make sure you change it to engine block, all right? Remember that. Now, what we're gonna do is we're gonna add some other things to it. 
Like I told you, it was gonna be the hood and the trunk. It's so easy, it's the easy part, all right? It's really just drag and drop from here. Now watch this. We're gonna show what's up under here. Let's see what's in here. Got a motor, right? We're gonna make that shake too. It's the engine, the whole engine, right? Drop engine inside engine block. Now that engine is gonna shake. Do the same thing for your bonnet, which is your hood to your car. Take that, drag it down, put it inside the engine block. Also your uh, trunk is the boot. On most cars it's called the boot. All right, drag that down into engine block. Now when you click off engine block, everything that you want to shake should be missing. Everything that you want to shake should be missing. All right, that's what we doing for now. We're gonna jump back in the game and we're gonna see how this thing look, all right? All right, man, right now we are in the game. Let me show you that this thing works. Man. All right, now the car is running, hit the trunk. 